Hi, and welcome to Santa's workshop. As you can see, today we have painted the upper part of the mill. Uh, it's barely dry yet, but uh, it will be. And now we need to make some, some wings for it. And we need a door and uh, some windows and so on. But that they are just uh, glued on to it. So <clears throat> we need to make a hole and, and some um, uh, stuff inside it. So it's a mechanical mill where, where the wings are rotating. So to do that, and you see here, yes, here's the wing. And uh, you can see I have made some holes here. And I will do the same. The goal is to, you can see, pull these uh, sticks in. So it looks like, I'll see if I can find where are my mill. I cannot find my mill anywhere. There it is. See? There is the wheel. So, and that's uh, the model we do, we make as close as we can come, but uh, as close as we can get. But, you know, it's, it's a model and it's a Christmas mechanical decoration, so. But uh, before we can do all that, we need to, I will adjust this camera a little, if I can figure out how I can. As you can see, I need to make some markings here. And where is the part? There is the part. And we need to make them precisely in the middle. And then it, and we know that they are not, go away. They are, nine millimeters times nine. So it will be like this. And we'll make a, Control mark in the other end also because then I'm sure I hit the right spot when I do like this. And I did. A couple of times so that I can see. I can see the pencil drawing. And then the first piece here is a half down here. Then it's one centimeters, one, one, two will get to the, the end. Someone would say, you could have done that on forehand. Yeah, yeah, but I did a thousand other things on forehand, so. There is a limit to everything, and especially time.
and in this, it seems like my hours are a little shorter than every, anyone else's, I think. Or maybe that's an age problem. The older I get, the faster the time goes. Why? I don't know. Anyway, it seems that way. When you was a kid, the days were very long. But uh, not anymore. <coughs> so, just give them a little so I can see where they are. But I think that's good enough. So we will go to this camera here, so you can see what I'm doing. And be careful now I'd put the light on, because I'm going to drain these holes. And they have to be precise. But sorry for the, the noise. <coughs> Move it a little way so I can get the hand in here. So. And they have to be pretty precise or else it will look weird. So. should stop blowing in the mic.
And then the other side. My legs hurt. <clears throat> and then I forgot one. Last one, I don't know why I didn't, but I do now. So, we can put this aside, close the light, and take it out. Please on the floor. in we want to paint it and I forgot because it's easier those those here has to be the same color as the the mill we used on the mill Where's the mouse here is you can see yeah can you still see the mill yes the same color as this one. 
so as you can see on the, on this part too but uh, I'll go and get the color I forgot that part but I have it out here so just a moment Always fun to see where I hit it. Here. Yeah. Yeah. That's the same. Same color as we used. And then we need something to have it and something to hold it. And the brush. And that little cup of a kind. No? You are ready. <laughs> Can you see anything here? Yes. First, we can put first paint them in one end and then another. Right? No, not that part out. So, and then we can turn. I could, I could breathe a hold in. No, we don't want that. We will do like this. Whoopsie. There was some some whack whackum in it. got paint out. there in the first this is pretty opaque so right. Clean. Uh, 
that. And now we don't want to fill the hose up with paint. And afterwards, when it's dry, we will. Uh, Just with hand put the uh, drill bit through. from the side. Now it is what it is. Regardless of what I could have done. No. This one on the inside. I didn't made a, make a rehab this time because we hit a, a recap, not rehab, recap, uh, because you can see the other if you decide to go ahead making something like this. For the kids next Christmas. Because I expect you to only wish tools this Christmas. And not a new iPhone, right? Or whatever. Whatever electronic gadget. So now we have to let it dry. I need to get something with the water in. <coughs> and that's out here. Pencil in to next turn. 
or a pencil brush. Pencil on in my language, a brush in yours or some of yours. Hard to see when they are dark. We will take a little bit later. So, and now we have another problem, or well, not a problem, but another task, or what we shall call it because we need to make all these white and normally I will I would have sprayed them but uh, I'm fresh out of white spray I think Or maybe not. Maybe not. How do we do that? Normally I have sticks in it, but uh, They will get very difficult to get through. How do we do this? Nope. Take this modern clay stuff here, and then we will just put it in like this. That's a small one. Of room between so I can get the brush out between it. Not more. <clears throat> and I think that was all the long ones, but I can see. Normally, 
normally when it's pointy I can just point them through the, the package but that's not possible this time. One long and the rest short. Should it be? Then we are ready to give them some white color. Can I have two more here? Or else we need to get a block on this block. Not take a block more. Well, we just do like this. Oops. So then uh, this is very close to that one. So then that should be the, all of them. And I need one more. And if I had t taken all of them at the first time I was out there, you can see. Then it didn't have to run that long, and the light we have here, so that's a good thing. Let's see if we get everything. Oh. And. I will remove this a little because I will go in to draw after a new brush. There's a way, and then start painting these. You know, it's a camera problem here. water in it. It's acrylic. So we can put water in it. Yeah, I think put 
Just a little squeeze. I think it will be much easier to put on. <clears throat> but as you can see, there are many little things. So you need to put the time aside for it if you. problem is that often people go go do stuff like this and then they abandon it to to later and my experience with with later is never so you has to get on with it while you think it but you first end up in the closet, broom closet, then, then the chance is that it never will get out again. And that would be a shame. Many, many people that have started on a boat or any, something like that. And given up, put it aside, and then next winter, it's kind of the same idea as when you, you in olden day when when you had all your photos, family photos in a shoebox, then when come to winter, I will fix them, sort them all, all the what do we call them? projector to show them on a canvas. Diapositives. Did we call them? I wonder. I'm not entirely sure if that's the right English word for it. But uh, The chance is that they are still in the shoebox. And that's a shame. And in this new digital world, with uh, Google storage and all that, and where Google can sort them, that's an amazing thing. They can find your dog between all your thousands of pictures and your daughter and son and aunt, whatever, your old parrot.
and that's without doing anything. Just upload them, and they will get sorted. But you cannot up upload this. <laughs> Maybe we can just upload a bunch of sticks one day and then say, build me a boat or a windmill. Well, in my age, you have learned not to reject funny suggestions like that. too much to do that. Never say never when it comes to crazy inventions. Okay. Many sticks. Be careful or they don't get so thick with the paint, then you will take the paint off when you put it in the, in the hole in the, in the wing. So it has to be a little sparse. Even 
that it's tempting just to put a lot on to get it covered. And we have been all the way around. <clears throat> Just take a look here. What that kind of look like? So I'll take a new one with some. Put some water in the new one, so I don't mix the white and the brown or red or whatever you will call it. Oh. <coughs> Sorry for this running around, but that's a part of the deal. When you do stuff like this, see now we can get on this one one more time. Dry enough, but maybe we should move a little. Because when you are too early on, then you don't, it don't flow together right. You don't have to do it that way. You can t 
take your time, drink some coffee, have some cookies, and enjoy the Christmas. Make good stuff in the kitchen. That's what we love. I think it's okay. But it's not much you read in an hour, as you can see, but we got our it's a, this camera. We nearly got this one finished. So when tomorrow we can put the wings on, and I hope uh, during the day, if nothing comes up, it always seems it does. But then we can put the the back part on also, as you. I will build that tomorrow. <clears throat> and this part you see here in the picture, the part where this rosetta here is. And then the wings on, and then we need the door here, and then the these windows there are one here and the two other up, and that's there are one opposite this one, and one opposite this one, and one opposite this one. I guess I'll see. It's hard to look, see from here. The monitor is far away, but uh, that was what we got done tonight, and I uh, hope I'll see you again tomorrow. So, bye-bye.